Okay, we're looking at different ways they said you in Shakespeare's day. Now, of course, we just use the modern you very often in the same way um, that they did back then, and they used that formally. Now, informally, they used these words. For example, thou. This thou means you, but it also only means you, the subject, which is why I've written in capital letters there. Whereas this thou, this the over here means you. So, whereas um, in English you would say you are going, in modern English you are going, um, are going with me. In Shakespearean English, you would say, thou art going with me, right? Because thou is the subject. But it changes if we need to use um, the object, right? So, I am going with you in modern day English would mean I am going with the make sense the the subject right which is why i've written it in um small letters there if it might make more sense to you if perhaps you speak french when you kind of know the difference between when to say to and toi right um in afrikaans very often you might start a sentence with yay um yay gaan saam met my maar ek gaan saam met jou so it's that sort of thing okay um so i hope that that is helpful especially to people who speak other languages it might be more intuitive to you guys right thy over here means your it's the possessive pronoun in the second person right your so i you are going with me thou art going with me i am going with thee but get your bag right so we'll say get thy bag Got it? The possessive pronoun over there in the second person. And of course, in modern English, we use you, in proper English at least, for plural. It can be one person or many people as long as we're speaking in the second person. However, in Shakespearean English, we use ye for you, plural, like you guys. Or in some parts of the world, they say y'all or use, but that is not formal English. Okay, so um, ye is you guys or you plural or in a language like Afrikaans it might be something like yella in a language like French it might be something like evu I think and in a language like um, Greek I think it's is it esis I think so yes esis mm -hmm. you guys basically right yella so I hope you guys have that you the subject thou the is you, the object, thy is yours, ye is you guys, the whole lot of you. Okay, thank you so much.